Hey guys, what's up? Alpha VR 370 here, bringing you another video. And today is the Total Victory Ladder episode two. And today our competitor is Furball six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We are going to see if he can walk away with one thousand Robux, or maybe just one. So if you didn't watch the first episode and you don't know how it works, how it works is we start off with 1,000 Robux and the goal is to clear stage four, just like how the game works. If you clear stage four, you will take the total prize that is available for that round. And each time the competitor runs, that is a round. That's what we're going to call rounds. On round one, if they complete the whole thing, they clear stage four, which is the first go, round one, they get 1,000 Robux the whole pot each time they fail on the next round the stage four prize the total prize will be decreased by half so it only gets lower the more you fail so you have to try to clear stage four as fast as possible but you don't have to necessarily go and clear stage four to get money. You can also complete stages one, two, or three for less money. Whenever someone clears stage one, they get an offer of Robux, and the amount of Robux is depending on what the total prize is for that round, and stage one will be 10% of the total prize. So if it's round two, since it's been decreased by half once from the 1,000, the total prize will be 500, so that means stage one, you take 10% of 500, that'll be 50 Robux for stage one clear on round two. The competitor will be offered the Robux and they can either decide to end the game and keep those Robux or risk it for a later stage. By the way, if you clear stage four, that's it for the game. You can't win any more Robux. That's it for the game. On stage two, it works the same, but remember each stage does get harder. So each stage will have an increase increased offer amount. Stage two will be 25% of the total prize. So if it was round one, the total prize is 1,000. So that means 25% would be 250 Robux if they clear stage two on the first try. Players will be offered the 250 if they clear stage two, or let me rephrase it, the 25% if they clear stage two, they can either walk away with it and end the game or risk it for stage three which will be 50% of the prize. So if it was round three, that'd be 250 Robux total because you decrease half from 1,000, that's 500. Decrease it by half again, that would be 250. And that would be 125 Robux if they clear stage three. So you see it does, each time you clear, obviously the prize, the offer increases and you can keep that on stage three or you can risk it for stage four for the total prize of that round. But remember, the more they fail, the shorter, the smaller the prizes get. So you wanna maybe play it not so risky and walk away with one of those higher prizes earlier on. Don't worry, we will have information on the right so you can keep up with us. On the right, there is a chart so you can see uh, what round we're on. And on the bottom, you can see what the offer will be if they clear that stage. So here we go, let's start with the first round. Here we go, we're starting it up and let's see if Furball aka Jake can get the dub. All right, Jake right now is onto Cannonball Castaway. He doesn't have as much experience with this game as Homeboy. So he might be trying to play it safe and go for one of those smaller prizes rather than the full 1k. But I mean like, let's see if he can surprise us and maybe get some big bucks. I mean like this first round is 100 Robux. So he could he could walk out with quite a bit. He's on to rotating ascent. If he can do this, oh he's rushing, but he got it. <laughs> That, that was a bit sloppy, but nonetheless, he got it. So he's backing 100 bro bucks. Let's see if he risks it for 250. It looks like he's going to keep it already. So that means Jake Furball678910 has won himself 100 bro bucks. So congratulations to him. We are doing a what? A, and he's down on Claws of Power. So it looked like that was the right decision. Congratulations to Jake. You have won 100 Robux. Thank y'all for watching this week's episode, and I will see y'all next time.